talked about last time, if you're coming through that four swing and you can't turn all the way, check one of the possible reasons why is because of a lack of internal rotation. What that does is also makes you arch your back a little bit to get that motion. So we wanna make sure that that hip stays loose so that you can actually rotate through it, okay? So a stretch I like to do over here is, we're gonna go ahead and go against the wall. So if you're a right-handed golfer, you're gonna do this on the left side. If you're a left-handed golfer, you're gonna do this on the right side, okay? So what we're gonna do is, come on over here, Jake. You're gonna go ahead and put your left, so let's say you're a right-handed golfer, go ahead and put your, you can actually turn all the way around, and then what we're gonna do is, you're gonna go ahead and put your left hip into the wall, bringing your left leg back, yep, there you go. Actually, your left leg back, yep, there you go. And then what you're gonna do is, you're gonna keep your hips straight, so don't let your hips turn this way or that way. You're gonna keep it nice and square, and then what you're gonna do is you're going to side glide right there into that wall. And you should feel that stretch across the side of that hip there. Woo! There you go. Hold it for about 20, 30 seconds or so, and then come back out into it, and then when you go back into it again, it should be a little bit looser. So keep on doing that until it loosens up all the way. And then with, actually let me make one more note here. With this foot here, if you actually turn the foot in like this, you actually feel a little bit more 